Ubik Racing. One, two, they come to the line. Ifrid on the left, Kirch on the right. Here we go, through turn number one. The red race suit, Oliver Kirch gets pushed a little bit wide. Oh, and that is, looks like it's a uh, Maximilian Camelander up into P3. And the uh, Alain Berishville, the Cosmic Cart, number 329 moving into second position. Yes, the Bernier Cart team driver, Alain Berishville, who finished second in last year's championship to Ifrid. Is there, oh, a bit of pumping and boring there. That's one of the MKC racing drivers. Was that, uh, not Jan Cock, I'm trying to see who uh, it was. It could have been, uh, Elia Papatina getting involved. There. Oh, there's an awful lot of bumping and barging away about just behind the leaders. And as uh, they emerge at the end of the opening lap, Samuel Ifrid leads by half a second over Alain Benishfield. Olivier Cratch is there in third position, followed by Kevin Ummel in fourth. Jan Koch is fifth. Then Joan Bischoff, upholding Bischoff family honours, is in sixth position. Elia Papachena is seventh. Then it's Samuel Satelli, followed by Maximilian Camalander. Max Camalander in ninth place. Then it's Gianluca Poggi, Lorenzo Roncaroni, Luca Pozzo, Leo Gupsa is in 13th place. The driver graduated from junior class last year. 14th is Samuel Shah. Then it's Tommaso Greco in 15th position. Watch for Tommaso Greco in cart number 342. Finished third in the opening heat race. Oh, and uh, that was one of the Ubik drivers there having a taking a right old chunk out of his nearest rival. That could have been Max Camelander uh, on... We'll have a little look as they come through. Yeah, Max Camelander's dropped back to 16th position uh, behind Dominic Dunner. Tommaso Greco is up into 14th position. Alejandro Jimenez is in 17th place. Tristan Koenig is 18th. And Nora Luaka. So we've got three Luakas racing. Nora is there in 19th place in cart number 323. Three. Peter Spengler is the best placed of the Masters drivers. Oh, and that's number 323. Three. That is Nora Luaka uh, having a brief rotation in the Grammy Power Sovdi cart. And there, well, there's only one Bischoff. It's Joan Bischoff who is... In seventh place, make that sixth position. Here is the battle for second place. Well, Samuel Ifrid is 1.8 seconds up the road. There's a move from Elia Papachena passing Kevin Ummel. Oh, no, two drivers off the 328. That is Fiorella Santarelli. And I couldn't quite see the other driver. Both drivers up and out of their carts. And uh, let's have a look as they come by next time around. Oh, I think it was Elia Jeromin. Elia Jeromin in cart number 304. And uh, Fiorella Santarelli coming to grief. So we're down to 28 runners now. Uh, a quick look at where Martin Pasandin is. He's 21st. And Pasandin has now got past Peter Spengler. So, but, oh, and somebody pulling off at the inside of the track there into the pit lane. Who was that? Or was that a slower driver going back to pits after an incident? No, it was Elia Papachena. Elia Papachena, I believe, has pitted, obviously with a mechanical problem there. Oh, and there's another cart slowing down. That uh, very deep black and yellow liveried cart. That is the number three, two, is, no, that's, it's the number 377 of Leo Gupsa, who, uh, Got it all wrong going into turn number five and lost a he whole heap of momentum. Meanwhile, back up towards the sharp end, lots of chopping and changing because of the amount of incidents we've had. This is the battle of the third place we're watching between the cosmic cart of Alain Berishville and then the number three one to that Lando Norris chassis of Kevin Ummel. We are... That's the sec that's the third and fourth place cart. Here's the battle of the fifth, and it is the yellow cart of Jean Bischoff in fifth. Then it's the number 305 cart of uh, Jan Koch in sixth position. Seventh is Samuel Satelli in the number 302 cart. Then it's Luca Pozzo and Samuel Shah in ninth position at the back of this group. And they've got another five or six carts right with them as well. Oh, and there goes uh, 
One of the drivers off wide, he swings back onto the line. That was right in front of Leo Gupsa and Lorenzo Roncaroni. Now, in the midst of all this, Tommaso Greco in cart number 342 is trying to make his way back up through the order. And uh, there is Bischoff from Koch, Satelli, Pozzo, Poggi, Shah. Greco now up into 11th position. This is 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, 13th. All the way back to Dominic Dunner in 13th position. Lorenzo Roncaroni has uh, slipped back to 14th position. It was Roncaroni who was uh, getting nerfed wide at the exit of turn number 12 last time around and losing position at this point on the circuit one lap ago. We're on lap number seven. Well, we're coming towards the conclusion of lap number number seven here in this 16 lap race so we're approaching half distance battle is on for second position the 329 cosmic of beersville under pressure from kevin ummel and ummel takes over p3 samuel ifrid and oliver cratch are well up the road ifrid leads by 2.1 seconds over cratch and cratch is 2.6 seconds in front of ummel who now runs into third position followed by Merishfield in fourth. Bischoff is another two seconds behind this group, or this battle, rather, in fifth position, and he has got mm, everybody else behind him. Koch, Satelli, Pozzo, Shah, Poggi, Greco, Gupsa, Dunner, Koenig, Jimenez, Schupman. Mark Schupman in sixth position, Maxim Harder in 17th, Henry Dos Santos is 18th, 19th is Michael Enns, then Kai Traub rounds out the top 20. Lorenzo Roncaroni is 21st. In 22nd position is Martin Passendin, who now le who leads the Masters division. Passendin, and he has got uh, Kamalanda right behind him. Then it's Peter Spangler, second in Masters. Third in Masters, 25th overall is Miro Svaguza. Then it's Marco Ranch. Ranch. Marco Ranch in 26th position and he is fourth in masters nora luaka in 27th place overall the only other driver still running elliot jerome and oh elliot jerome and fiorella santarelli have continued they're a lap down after their incident elia papachena and james bischoff out of the race samuel ifrid our race leader sets a new fastest lap 50.096 seconds but this battle is the best answer oh and there's it it's all gone wrong for three of them no make that four of them carts running very wide coming out of turn number three three carts four carts getting turned around oh one driver there two drivers out of the race that is the number 377 cart of leo gupsa out for the race oh tommaso greco also in trouble no, i didn't see what happened now gupsa and greco i think came together and Two other drivers there in a, taking avoiding action out of the base there. Oh, poor old Greco. Tommaso Greco stomps away from his stranded go-kart. The number 342 IRT Racing Energy Core chassis will go no further. Now, this has moved Dominic Dunner up into a 10th position. Maxim Harder is 11th. Alejandro Jimenez is now 12th. Henry Dos Santos is 13th. Michael, in my ends, is 14th, followed by Tristan Conning in 15th position. Kai Trau up to 16th. Lorenzo Roncaroni is in 17th. And in 18th place still is Martin Passendin, your Masters leader. Gianluca Poggi was another one of the drivers involved in that incident of a turn number three, along with Max Camelander. They have dropped to 19th and 20th position, respectively. None of this, of course, matters to Samuel Ifrid, whose lead over Oliver Cratch remains a solid two seconds. Here comes the battle of the third. Alain Biersville back up the inside of Kevin Ummel. Three laps in exactly the same position when Ummel passed Biersville for third position. It is now Biersville back in front. Here is Jan Koch and Samuel Satelli battling for sixth and seventh positions cock in cart number three zero five satelli in cart three zero two behind them 
is Luca Pozzo and then Joan Bischoff in ninth position. That huge train of carts, uh, which well, lost four of its members about two laps ago and uh, has now been sort of spread out ever so slightly. But uh, these two drivers on your screen battling for the third and final podium position. The 329 of Alain Bierschville and the 312 of Kevin Ummel. They are five seconds behind Oliver Cratch, who is in second position. So it really is a head-to-head -head fight on this lap. 13 out of 16 for the final podium position here in Francia Corta. Out of turn number 13. Down the straight into 14. Ummel pushing Biersfield along. And I have to say, Samuel Shah is closing in on this duo. Shah, you can see Shah appearing the back of this camera shot. Now, Ummel retakes third position as we start lap 14 of 16. The man on the move is Samuel Shah. The more that Ummel and Biersfield battle, the closer that Shah will get. In cut number three, nine, three, Samuel Shah eating into this battle. Rather, eating into the gap that separates him from the battle in front. And as he sort of lips it, licks his lips and wipes his mouth with his napkin and puts his knife and fork to one side because... He has eaten into it and is now with this battle. Across the start finish line, through turn one. Hard on the anchors now at turn number two. It's a three cart scrap for the final podium position on this lap 15 of 16 at Francia Quarter. Out of turn number five, up the hill through turn number six. The skies overhead are gray, but they remain dry. Any rain will be dissipated, I am sure, by the fact that this tarmac is red hot with all the action that's going on. Here comes Samuel Shah up the inside of Beersville for fourth place. He's got momentum on his side with just over a lap to go. That was critical for Samuel Shah. He had the momentum and he went straight past Beersville without sort of losing that momentum and falling back into the pace that Beersville was running. He can carry on running his own pace, and his own pace is quick enough to get him onto the podium. The question is, has he got enough time left to get on the podium? Because we're on the final lap. Samuel Ifrid and Oliver Cratch won one and two for the Ubik Racing Team. Jan Schmitter's boys are doing the business up at the front, and here comes, oh, there goes Shah. He has a nibble at the rear bumper of Ummel's cart, but Ummel fights him off. Kevin Ummel, the prima clima racing driver. Here comes Sam Ifrid, meanwhile. He takes the checker flag and the win. Cratch is second. Ummel is there for third. Oh, and on the grass is Shah. Beersfield got to the inside of Shah and forced him wide to the final corner. And Ummel will complete the podium. Beersfield in, in fourth place. Shah has to make do with fifth. Samuel Satelli comes home in sixth position.